YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Hey, it's your boy Andrew on this beautiful, bright, hot, Texas sunny day. As y'all can see, we already sweating, but so decided to take my first load with the Butler trailer this morning while everybody was tucked away, sleeping, you know, sound asleep. I was having issues with my other trailer at this carrier, and uh, it was some uh, some air leaks that was delaying the amount of time it took for me to unload sand. So I decided, you know, while everybody sleep at 12 midnight, I'm just gonna sneak on over to the yard, swap trailers, ain't nobody paying attention. Let me go get loaded right quick. And let me go see if I can offload. And then, you know, that way if something goes wrong, I can, I got a couple of hours before 6 a.m., you know, before the Tsum Tai guys wake up to figure out what I'm gonna do with this big load of sand that's stuck in the trailer, cause that's what I thought was gonna happen. <laughs> you know, Andrew don't got all the answers, you know. I was thinking the worst thing that could go wrong with this Butler trailer is some kind of way a pipe bust, and then I gotta figure out how I'm, what I'm gonna do with like 40,000 pounds of sand stuck in the Butler trailer. But that ain't, that ain't what happened. So, like I said, got loaded, went to the well, and uh, we started with the last part first. Uh, the last part, that unloaded successfully with no leaks. But when I got to the second part, y'all saw that uh, sand, we had a small sand leak started to shoot out between the um, the uh, the new clamps that I had installed, which one of my own operator friends out here who just bought a trailer, he did tell me that uh, those was gonna leak because he got them on his trailer. And um, he did tell me that that was, that was gonna happen. Um, so because he told me I had already bought four rubber boots brand new from Krauf, and uh, I said, well, if it, if it leaked, then I just have it replaced. And sure enough, it did leak. But even though we was leaking sand, the trailer still unloaded. And um, the trailer is good. The trailer is good. It, it worked perfect. And uh, I just dropped it off at one of my mechanic shops. He's going to take the, all those those clamps off. And we're going to go back with the old style rubber boots. But we got brand new boots. So the trailer will be ready in a couple of hours. And uh, we can go for a second run with it and uh the second run we shouldn't have any issues whatsoever other than that it's time to work on the truck so whoo it's time to work on that truck man we got that cooling tank up there still holding it with that jb well sale look at that yeah, all that jb up there all that jb well yeah it's still holding it's still holding it fellas but hey guess what fellas yeah, it's still holding, but guess what, fellas? Wait a minute now. Wait a minute now. Got them crots on. Got them crots. Got them crots on out here. Okay, okay. We got a box. What's in the box, Andrew? We got a box, fellas. We got a box. Been waiting up here at the pallet. Uh oh, we got a box with tape on it. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on now. We got a box, fellas. Uh oh, what could be in a box? What could be in a box? We don't know. What that is right there? What that is right there? What is that? Oh, what is this? We got another box. Oh, is this just. There's nothing in that, fellas. There's nothing in that one. Okay, we got a box, fellas. What is that? What could that possibly be? Oh, it's kind of heavy. Oh, oh, okay. Wait a minute. Hold on, fellas. We got some black up in here. Wait, what, what could it possibly be? Oh, this is heavy. Wait a minute. Hold on. I don't even know if I can grip this one hand. Hold on. Hold on. It's stuck on something. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on, fellas. It's stuck on something. I got to sit the phone down. Let me, let me Give me a second now. All right, all right, what could it be? What is that, Andrew? What is that, Andrew? Oh, look at that, hold on now, what is that? What is that? What is that, what, go, what, what is that? Could it be? Let me go wipe the dust off that, could it be? Wait a minute, is that, is that who I think it is? Wait a minute, that can't, is that the same company? Is that the same company? That I'm running that aftermarket Mercedes being overhauled from it. That, that is the same car. Look at that. What is that? What is that? Look at that. What is that? What is it? Okay, 
I'll just put it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, so we uh, we got a cooling tank, y'all. Uh, this one came from Ramsey Chrome Shop. I don't even know if it fit. I don't even know if it's the right one. But uh, I'm going to set it up here with the old one and see um, if this right here will fit or not. Got this, like I said, from Ramsey uh, Chrome Shop Online. Got it uh, shipped over here to the pallet. Uh, truck stop out here in Odessa. This one, I believe it was about a hundred and it was between a hundred to two fifty. I put the price on YouTube stories, so you know, I don't, you probably ain't on that no more because it's been past a week. But um, it said it was for my truck, you know, the dealership wanted eight hundred, nine hundred dollars. And uh, let me just see if some things match up right quick. So we got two, uh, we got two. Uh, these things right here, we got one right there. That's for the overflow. I don't know this one right here. I need to go check out. So let's go check it out, fellas. On this bright, beautiful. What's today? Tuesday. 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 Okay. Let me go to the other side. Hold on, fellas. Now hold on. How y'all doing today, anyway? Okay. Now let me see something. Okay, there it is right there. Okay, so that bottom piece comes out right there. Okay, we got that. We got the overflow overflow tube right here. You know, they just hang down like that. Get that excessive uh, cooling up out of there. And we got them two hoses right there coming down off the top. Look, we got, a, we got that cooling sensor right there. Look at that. We got the cooling sensor. Okay, let me make sure everything look right. Okay, hold on. Okay, let me go look at the cooling tank. Let's go look at the cooling tank. We ain't got no trailer right now because Miko. Did y'all hear that music when I walked in Miko's shop? Did y'all hear that music? Been telling y'all about that music. You won't work done the same day. Okay, cooling, cooling sensor goes right there. Okay. Got that hose. Now, does it come straight? Now, these are angled right. This right here, that ain't no issue. Does this, this, that right there, does it come straight? We got, okay. Let me look at it again. Okay, let me flip it up. Okay. Mm-hmm. Let me look at it again. Does it come straight? Does it come straight? Did y'all hear that music? I mean, I walked in there, boy, they were playing that Latino music, boy. They were jamming in there. I said, yeah, yeah, this right here. They they ready to work today. I said, they ready to work today. Okay, that one comes out to the right a little bit. Comes out to the right, but it's a hose, so they could just obviously be adjusted those up in there that can be adjusted uh-huh yeah, as long as it don't hit that fan right there this clamp right here can come off uh, and we can just readjust the hose or we can just get a longer one that ain't no problem whatever we need to do but uh okay the rest of it is right uh-huh shift that bolt pattern two boats right there go look at it again fellas did y'all see that dog did y'all see how big that that German shepherd was i like that dog the dog very friendly then we got the two boat patterns okay we can put one two we can put three we can put three okay for we in business it's looking good looking good fellas Boom, we got the cooling tank. Okay, so what's next, Andrew? We got the cooling tank. Boom, right there. You just, I just saw it now. I just showed you. That's all it came with, huh? So, we can either go and buy new hoses or we can use the old ones that's already up there. Uh, we'll worry about that later. We need to go check one more thing now. We was talking about that blue uh, heater hose, that silicon heater hose to replace underneath this terrible right here. Where that right there, right there. Get that hose right there. As you can see, as you can see, it's already starting to get ready to splice right there. So what I'm finna do, we're gonna take this clamp off right there and uh, we're gonna keep the edge right there. We're gonna take that to fleet press so we can get the correct size. We're gonna get about 10 feet. I think that hose right there, I think it runs along this firewall, this, this, this wall right here, all the way to the back underneath there. And I think, I think it connects right here. Boom, right there. I think that's where it's connecting to, right there. Okay, so like I said, it just rides straight on down smooth. See how it go against that right there, all the way to the front? That's why I tracked it to. I think it's it right here. It just ran that cooling through there. 
you know what I'm saying? Just run that coolant to the back of this sleeper right there. So, uh, yeah, we're going to cut that hose, take that over here to Fleet Pride. Fleet Pride. Fleet Pride on the other side of this building right there. They already got the... They already got the uh, the holes. The one I got last time was too big. So this time we're going to cut one off. We're going to cut a piece of chunk off the old holes. Take that to Fleet Pride so we get the correct size. And uh, after that, man, we still got to replace these two front shots right here. Y'all know we already did the back shots, the front shots. We already replaced all this right in here. It's just, remember, we freight line and sold us the wrong shots. So, you know, now these shots are still good. But like I said, they ain't been replaced. The rest of them new. So one, two, two shots. Okay, two shots. Uh, and that hose right there. And then if we want to replace brand new hoses on now, you know, we could do that too. Other than that, man, once we uh, once we do these repairs, uh, that's it right there. Yeah, that's it for the flat top. Uh, we done replaced everything. Uh, we could do smaller, smaller uh, things. It's always something to replace when you're on the truck. You know, uh, brake chambers, you know, tires, brake pads, you know, there's always something you can replace. It's grease, you know. Truck right now, truck needs some lotion. It needs some lotion right now. Look how dry that is right there. Look at all that right there. It needs some lotion, I'm trying to tell you. Might have to go see Migos, pay them to put some lotion on here. That's why we ain't breaking nothing on the lease roll right now, because we, we keep it lotionized. Yeah, we keep it lotionized. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, Migos always check. He always top me off if I need to be topped off over there with, 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 the, with the differential and the transmission floor. Yeah, he do all that right there. Migo do everything. I'm trying to tell you now. I told you, Migo. I told you who do it. Migo, y'all keep at Andrew. Why you won't give us the shop? All the other YouTubers give us a shop. I did give it a shop, man. I told you, Migo. What you talking about, man? Pick up the phone and call Migo. Andrew, who is Migo? Andrew, I don't understand. You know, me, no, no. I don't understand, Andrew. Me, no, no. I don't know either, man. Pick up the phone, type in Google Maps, diesel mechanics, and what you can do if you specifically looking for Migos, just pick up the phone, call them at the shops, and when you hear Migos, pick up the phone. That is the shop you need to aim for. Okay, I'm just. <laughs> they like look, they looking like Andrew, man. What you talking about, man? We we rebuilt your truck, man. We ain't no damn Migo. I know you ain't Migo. Calm down, now. This Migo do good work too, though. Uh oh, I got a phone call coming in. Uh oh, I got a phone call. Got to go. Okay, we back on the take two. My bad. We had some trolls calling in. A couple of trolls that found my phone number. Uh, like I said, it's always something to do. We could change the oil and the blower. It don't hurt to change the oil in the blower. Hey, matter of fact, it don't hurt to change the oil up there in that Mercedes being engine either. While we putting the lotion on there, is all I'm saying. It don't hurt. Look at that. Look at them tires right there. Look at that. It don't hurt. Let's see, we got a new tire right there and the old tire right there. Look, it's this. Is this grandpa? This is grandpa. And look at grandpa. Grandpa then. Boy, I done made my money off these tires ten times over. Look at grandpa. Look at all that. Look at grandpa. Look, he's still. I, I got a tread duff in now. I, I got a tread duff gauge in there, fellas. You wanna know if it's still there? I got a tread duff gauge in now. Grandpa is still legal. This this tag, this tire, them two tires over there, it came with the truck. Look, and them steel tires. Yeah, it came with the truck. Look at grandpa on here holding on tight, doing his job. Look at all that right there. Man, I call a nail in this tire. I didn't forget to. No, I think it was that tire. I wonder if that nail came out. Oh, look, that nail still right there. Look at that, fellas. I forgot all about that nail, man. I, I ended up flying home. Now, what I need to do about that? It look like I can just leave it right there. Yeah, it ain't flat. It look like I need to just leave it right there. What y'all, somebody comment down below. Tell Andrew about this nail situation. That's too close to the firewall if I go to TA. But if I go to Miko now, if I go to Miko, Miko gonna flip this tire inside out. He gonna patch all right up in now. He ain't gonna be talking about no. It's too close to the firewall. We can't do it. You got to give us the whole. No, 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 no. That's that's that loves TA Migo. Now Migo can patch close to the firewall. Is all I'm. Migo can do that, but TA and loves who is too close to the. Me no no. Saying so, I need somebody to know. I need somebody to do know. Okay, do know. Not no no. Do know. Okay, now tell me about that tire in the comment section down below, fellas. And, uh, yeah, like I said, the trailer been dropped off. And, uh, yeah, man.
We ready to go, man. We were rock and roll. We need to get Pippin back when it's time. It's time to return Pippin, Pippin trailer. Now we didn't hear it too long. Now we didn't hear Pippin trailer way too long. It's time to give it back. We definitely thank. We definitely thank them for letting us uh, you use the trailer. Uh, it was a, it was a wonderful trailer. Oh, it was wonderful. It got the job done. But it's time for me to pass the torch to uh, somebody else. Another owner operator need a trailer around here, three hundred a week. Uh, it's time for me to pass the torch. Now, if you want Andrews or uh, Lisa trailer, uh, I already gave it back. Matter of fact, it's in that deal. Uh, Consider it gave back. <laughs> no, I ain't, get, I ain't gave it back yet, but I'm just saying. Uh, but, anyways, we're gonna get on up out of here. Um, I'm gonna go to the gym and I'm just gonna wait for this trailer because they close at five. It's what noon right now. And you're gonna go to the gym, man, burn about two, 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 200 calories. Is that good enough? 200 calories? Burn about 200 calories. Yeah, I'm going to trade me. I'm going to do a mile. I'm going to do a mile on the treadmill, man. Andrew ain't been to the gym in about two months. So I need to get my fat ass on up in there, man. Get, get some of that jogging in. Mm -hmm. Get some of that good jogging in. And, uh, you know, hit that bench press. You hit the bench press. Hit the, you get some of that. Now, work on that chest. They like the chest, fellas. They like the chest, okay? So get that bench press in and get that jogging going because uh, they don't like them too big. Now, you can't be, you know, they don't they don't want to well. So you got to stay in shape. Now, drink drink lots of water now. Drink lots of water and uh, stay in the gym, okay? Stay in the gym now. Now, I'm going to get on up out of here now. And uh, y'all have a good day. Like I said, comment, like, share. Whatever you gotta do, I ain't told you now. I ain't told you what we got that cool and tame. If, if it's a problem with it, I'll let you know whenever, whenever I get Migos to install it. Uh, other than that, man, I think that's it for the day, fellas. <laughs>